Local 4 News begins right now with a breaking news alert. Breaking news on this Saturday morning. Police are searching for a hit and run driver who hit a Detroit police officer right now, leaving him in critical condition. And we've recently learned that officer is currently listed in critical condition after he was rushed to the hospital not long ago. In surgery right now, investigators telling us this all happened before 3 a.m. in the area of Southfield Road and McNichols on the west side. Nick Monticelli live in northwest Detroit as DPD and MSP continue to search for that driver. Nick, I know you just got an update from Detroit police. Yeah, Sean, it's an all out manhunt right now. They've got Southfield PD, Michigan State Police, and of course the Detroit Police Department all searching for this driver that critically injured this young officer from Detroit. Now you can see behind me, the scene is still incredibly active, trying to figure out exactly what happened here. And what's interesting is that there are actually two different scenes. This one near McNichols and Avon, which is maybe a mile, no, maybe half a mile west of the freeway, and then a separate scene just east of the freeway where the officer's boot was found. Take a look at this video. We have been out here for over two hours now. This happened, as you mentioned, around 2.30 in the morning, and officers were at this location because there was a huge party that they were called in and asked to shut down and dispersed so they've got all that going on and then as the whole thing is wrapping up as the officers are getting ready to leave specifically this one officer is getting back in his patrol car another vehicle comes flying down to Nichols and hits him from behind sends him flying and right through the windshield it was a horrible situation the officers that were here with him started doing first aid on him and then realized we need to get him to the hospital immediately they threw him in the back of their own scout car and rushed him to Sinai Grace Hospital. As you mentioned, he is in surgery right now, listed in critical condition. As of right now, they're not sure if he is going to make it. They are hoping and praying all of that can happen. In the meantime, they are devoting all of their resources to try to get somebody arrested for all of this. Again, it's a hit and run driver, so you don't know who's involved here. All they know is that it's a dark colored, maybe a black or a blue SUV, and it does have extensive damage to the front, the bumper possibly, and the windshield. Again, happening around 2.30 at West McNichols and the Southfield Freeway. If you saw anything, please call the Detroit Police Department. In the meantime, it is a difficult situation for the officers as they try to do their uh, investigation out here working the scene and also at the hospital standing over guard praying for their comrade. Sean, Sandra. Horrible situation for that officer and the department, but Nick, you know those officers are spreading out now looking for video that may have captured that hit and run driver. Absolutely. In fact, there is a green light location, probably I'm going to say two or three blocks away from the original scene. In fact, now I see two green light locations. So at the very least, you may not see the incident, but you should see the vehicle. As you know, those cameras are incredible. They're high definition. They can really capture some good details even in the middle of the night. And DPD has great access to those cameras as well. They can pull them up instantly. So hopefully very soon they should have an idea of who or what they are looking for. As soon as we get a description of that vehicle or a picture, we'll put it right out. Nick Monticelli will check in with you in just a bit. Thank you.